So we are doing a few stretches for uh, doing better breathing uh, because when you have tightness in the shoulders, chest and upper back, your breathing suffers. So we are going to just do a few stretches quickly. I will show you. The first one is a side stretch which will help your, you to open up the sides of your ribcage. So you are going to turn your arm out. Inhale, lift your hand up. Take your hand on your upper back. Exhale and bend to the side. So when you are doing this, you are going to hold it for 5 breaths and notice your breaths on the right side of your chest. Make sure that you are not leaning forward with your trunk when, when, when you start. And now I'm going to release, inhale, come up, exhale and release. You do it on the other side, open your arm out, inhale, lift, bend your elbow, exhale to the side. Feel the chest, feel the chest opening on the side and feel your breaths there. Now to complete, you inhale and come up. So every time you are stretching, you are holding for at least 5 to 6 breaths and notice the breath on that side. Okay. Now we are going to do the next one where you are going to open the chest, the top chest and the front of the chest. Hold your hands at the lower part of your ribcage and squeeze your shoulders back, squeeze your elbows back and feel the chest opening up. And take again 5 to 6 breaths, making sure that your belly is not inflating. So keep your belly towards the spine and feel the breaths in your chest region. After completing 5 to 6 breaths, you can release your hands down. And now we are going to do the next stretch. So this stretch is going to open up your upper back or the back part of your lungs. So for this, I'm going to just sit upright again, shoulders over the hips, exhale, go forward and if you have a large belly, you can increase the distance in your legs and if you don't, you can keep your feet together closer and just hug, give yourself a nice hug. If you feel this is putting pressure on the heart, then you can keep your hands on the ankles. You are going to breathe in and out and allow the upper back to open up. It will help you to open up the back of your lungs. Again, take 5 to 6 breaths here. Inhale as you come up. And now we are going to do the next one where you are going to lean back on the chair. So if you have a backrest which is this height, you will be able to do it very easily. So I am going to exhale, take the belly in first and keep it there throughout the practice. Lift the hands up and lean back on the chair and throw my hands back. Opening up the armpit. If you don't have any cervical or if you don't have any spondylitis issue in your neck, you can lift your chin up and again see the breaths in, feel the breaths in your armpits, your chest region. So the armpits open up and help, that helps to open up the chest. Just feel that breath on your next Exhalation, come up and release. So if you feel discomfort in any of these positions, you can always come back. Okay, don't continue. Now we do the next, the last of the stretches which is a twist. This will help you to open the lungs again. So you are going to take your right hand on the left knee. This is my left knee, this is my right hand and sit upright on an inhalation breath. On the exhalation, you are going to turn. So you can make your twist more intense by taking the left shoulder a little more behind. Keep the belly towards the spine always. And now feel the breaths in the left side of your lungs. Again, maintain for 5 to 6 breaths and come back on inhalation. Again, repeat on the other side. Take your left hand on the right knee. Exhale, inhale, sit upright. Exhale and twist. 
Again, feel your breaths on the right side of your chest. You can look straight ahead. And now on the next inhalation breath, come back to the center. And now after doing all the stretches, just feel the difference in your breath. So the change in your breathing, the freedom in your breaths. Okay, thank you for watching. And please, I urge you to follow this video at least three to four times in a week. Thank you.